Welcome back. Time now to get real. And to begin this segment tonight, I want to show you a clip of former Vice President Joe Biden from yesterday in Delaware. Old Joey from the block was holding a virtual roundtable discussion about the coronavirus with health officials and business owners and others. That's when he decided to act like CNN and a fear monger trying to scare the hell out of Americans by making his baseless claim about the number of dead Americans that we could see again just by January. And the number to me is staggering. Take a look. Well, Christmas is going to be a lot harder. And, you know, I, want, I don't want to scare anybody here, but understand the facts. We're likely to lose another 250,000 people dead between now and January. You hear me? Because people aren't paying attention. People aren't paying attention. You hear me? I hear you, Joey. 250,000 in two months. Okay, where do I begin? You and your Democrat cronies, from Pelosi and Newsom to Whitmer and Cuomo, and your lapdog media activists, have all been caught on camera during this pandemic breaking your own lockdown orders. But now, as you think you've gained the reins, you sit there and you spew this fear-mongering rhetoric to the American public. Really, Joe? Come on, man. You expect us to believe that with what we know now about the virus that we didn't know back in March when the lockdown started, with the vaccines right around the corner coming out, with therapeutics now being used, with social distancing measures in place across the country, and the fact that more and more Americans are now aware of how the virus is transmitted, you expect us to believe that another quarter of a million people could die in the next two months when the current death toll is around 272,000. You really want us to buy that so that you can continue with these draconian style lockdowns while millions and millions of families and business owners struggle to make ends meet. And as Christmas approaches, you, as the potential next leader of our great nation, want us to now lay down and obey. Joey, I'm not buying what you're selling. And I don't think the majority of Americans in this country are buying it either. So Joe Biden, do us a favor. Get real and shut up. All right, that's going to do it for the show tonight. If you'd like to reach out to us, by all means, you can email, Facebook, Twitter. I try to respond to as many as I can every day, folks. Hope to see you tomorrow night, 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. But until then, be proud, be safe. God bless. <laughs>